Hey guys, what is going on? It is your dog, Nicky Dog here, and welcome back to my channel. Um, today is Saturday, so basically what's going to be happening is every Saturday I'm going to have a vlog. As I've said before, I'm going to have two types of vlogs. First vlog is going to be on Wednesdays, which are updates and different things going on, maybe uh, things on my channel, stuff like that. And I decided, you know what, I'll pick another day to have something, and I'm going to have a little series called It's Saturday. So this is going to be It's Saturday, Episode 1. Um, basically, I'm just going to be talking about a couple different things, just depending on the topics I want to talk about. So for today, let's start off with my first topic. I saw Cubo and the Two Strings the other day, and man, what a fantastic film that is. Like, it's made by a company called Leica. They make, like, stop-motion, kind of origami-feeling uh, characters and things like that. And I just got to say, their animation was on point for this film. I really enjoyed it. I wanted just a good film with good story and heart, and this film hit all those points terrifically. Like, I really care about the main character, and the characters you meet along the way were great, and they didn't feel like they stood out at all, because, like, they're played by some big actors like Matthew McConaughey, Charles Theron, just really great actors. And overall, I ended up going to this film with not knowing too much except for seeing a couple of trailers, and I ended up really liking it. It was a fantastic film. And ended with a good note and the ending of the film had something special for people who were still at, there at the end of the credits so it was pretty nice but yeah if you guys haven't seen Cubo and the two strings you should really see it it's a good film it's uh, made by the people who did like Paranorman or uh, Caroline those films Cr really great films to be exact too but yeah I really enjoyed the film it was a good film to uh, it wasn't a big blockbuster film it was just a small film that was made with a good budget. It was just really made well. And I really want to buy that when it comes out, so I'll probably buy that. But yeah, there's that. And then another thing I just felt like I should talk to you guys about is uh, I'm going to be starting back to school next week. Yeah, next week, sorry. Uh, yeah, so basically, I just thought I'd talk to you guys about that because I've been uh, doing my channel during the summer. I started like in the middle of the summer so I kind of feel stupid that I started there because I could have had way more videos out before I started school but yeah I didn't do that so basically I'm starting next week uh, in the middle of the week mostly I'm pretty sure they're not gonna be handing out too much work for me so at least for the next two weeks I'll still be able to do regular reactions pretty positive and not that I'm going to stop doing any reactions or any videos in general, I'm just not going to be uh, probably as, I don't know the word, I'm not going to be doing it like probably as much, but I am, I'll probably still strive for it, like maybe there will be one off day where I don't have as many as I might do, but I still really want to get my videos out for you guys because I care about you and I care about the videos I want to create for you and Overall, it's a nice thing to do on the side, and I really enjoy it. It's fun, and I'm starting school back up, so, I mean, it might give me some, not problems, just maybe give me some predicaments where maybe I won't be able to upload and stuff like that, but, yeah, I just thought I'd let you guys know I'm starting school soon, and I'll still be able to get my reactions out, so there's that. And, yeah, guys, another thing... I have a birthday coming up, and that is next month, uh, turning the big 18, going into the adulthood, um, and man, I cannot believe I'm turning 18, like, it's a big step, because I'm becoming an adult, and as much as I probably won't feel like it's changed, it's going to be a different change at least because when you turn 18 it's like you have to still do the same things but you have all these new responsibilities because pick up like not even parents just adults in general are going to start think start looking at you as an adult and they're not going to baby you not that i get babied but it's just kind of like you have to learn more things and it's just all about growing and I cannot believe I'm already turning 18, and I will say I have been waiting for this day for a while, but at the same time now I'm like a little bit, not worried, just a little bit like cautious, I guess you could say. 
but I am pretty enthusiastic about it. Uh, I'm actually gonna have a party. I've never actually had a real. Well, I've had a. Okay, I guess I've had a couple parties, but that was like when I was younger. And I had a small get together last year, but that was about it. But this year, I'm actually having like an actual party, going swimming at the pool. You know, I might be able to film it. I don't know. We'll see if I'm able to get someone to film it for me, or maybe I'll just hold the camera. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know. If you guys even want to see that. Basically, today is kind of just starting the first episode off with me talking about the movie and then just a couple things coming up. I'll start, yeah, so every Saturday, guys, uh, I thought about doing the, you know, walk around, stuff like that, and there probably will be a time when I still do that, like, and maybe it's Saturday episodes, but I don't know. I just, like, it, there's not too much to do because, one, uh, not there's not that many places just near me I can go and walk to. And I only have my permit right now, so I'm not really able to drive places on my own yet. But once I get my license, which will be later this fall, then, uh, yeah, I think I'll do some more, like, walking around vlogs and stuff like that, because I'll be able to go places. And you'll see more people on my channel, hopefully, because um, you'll see Joel, and I want to get one of my uh, good friends on the channel as well. Because I want you guys to uh, not just see me all the time. Because when I do reaction videos, like I want other people to be in there. We can discuss them and stuff like that. And uh, yeah, I should be doing a couple videos for the reactors leak soon sometime. I'm not exactly sure when, but I've been in contact in contact with that. So yeah. But yeah, guys, I just thought I'd do uh, my first episode, kind of chill, not really edited, really. Just kind of like you guys get to communicate with me. Well, I get to communicate with you, and you guys can communicate with me. I feel like I'm going to start opening up the uh, discussion part of the channel, where like you guys can just type something in my, the main part of my channel. I don't know, I'll see about that. But yeah, guys, and I'm almost... A couple of you guys have mentioned that I am almost to 500 subscribers. That is pretty insane actually because I I had uploaded one video and then my some of my videos get featured in like reaction like dual reactions with a whole bunch of other youtubers and one of them like hit like 30k or something I don't know like just one of my videos kind of went not viral but they went out there in the reactor world so a lot of you guys have found me because of that so hi and welcome to my channel <laughs> uh, but yeah really excited about the future of my channel guys I'm really starting to plan some things I have some uh, mental notes in my head and I think you guys are gonna enjoy um, just what I have in store if you guys enjoy my channel you probably will enjoy the content that I have coming out because I had just finished Death Note which was man one hell of a fantastic series that I seriously loved and just, just a, what a great show uh, I do know that they are making an actual American live action adaptation of the show, not just like Japanese shows that I know they've made, or t uh, movies in the Japanese world. But now they're having an American live adaptation of the show come to life with like Nat Wolf and uh, William Dafoe as Ryuk or something I heard about this. So I really want to see it. And I know a lot of people are probably always hesitant about that stuff because like it's American, it's not in the Japanese form. Honestly, it's Death Note. I just want to see it in American form. See, I'll probably do a review of that or whatever. And also do a review of Death Note probably Monday or something like that. I've been saying that. A lot of stuff going on, guys. A lot of stuff going on. But I am so excited and I am so glad that you guys are here to witness all of this with me. Because I just love having YouTube. Because YouTube, I can express all this stuff. I can talk to you guys. Because... I'm not going to go too big in a rant because this is the first video I don't want you guys to get too bored, but I don't have any siblings, you know? I'm an only child, and not that that is a bad thing, I had just been always not alone, not alone, that's not the word I want to use, but I've always been kind of to myself. I've made friends, and I think later on in different episodes I'll talk about other things that have happened in my life, uh, but for right now... This past year is the most I've ever made friends, I'll say that much. 
and now I'm coming into a new year with all these great friends. And yeah, I kind of cope with them because I don't have any siblings to talk to. I always have to talk to my friends about maybe even personal things because, you know, that's just who we go to. If you had siblings, you would go talk to your siblings unless you weren't close, but most people are to an extent. And I go to my friends, and that's the thing you gotta learn. Like, a lot of people say, like, only child people are spoiled, and I will say I probably was given more as an only child, but in a way, it kind of didn't ruin me because I kind of wasn't that much of a popular person, so a lot of things have happened to me, I'll say, that have really had me change my look on life, and I've been able to cope with being an only child because there are times when I feel lonely and I'm like, you know what, I wish I had siblings, but at the same time, maybe I wouldn't, but yeah, just a thing I, I deal with, and I like being able to have YouTube as a kind of a forum because I get to talk to all of you guys and it's like, you know what, I can express myself more with you. So, yeah, that's just another thing I thought I'd mention, but yeah, a lot of different things I wanted to talk about with you here. So, you know, come back every Saturday, uh, bring your friends, tell your friends because uh, if, you, if they like stuff that you like and they enjoy even the stuff that I have for you, then totally bring them on because I want to have all anyone who enjoys reactions, vlogs, uh, review stuff, really anything. For the gameplay, I might do one Happy Wheels video a week just for like beginning uh, kind of gaming stuff on my YouTube channel. Maybe we'll do like Would You Rather and Happy Wheels once a week. I'm still planning different things. I have so many ideas in my head that I'm wrapping around. I'm just having a fun time with YouTube right now because all of you guys are starting to come on and I'm like I'm kind of getting like blown up more and more so I'm like damn so I think once I hit a thousand which I think is actually possible I mean it's only with you guys that I can make that happen so thank you again for even bringing me this far and if you want to bring me to a thousand that would be just amazing of you all I'll do a special video for a thousand that I have planned uh, but besides that, um, just thank you guys again for all of your support. And oh yeah, so also if I hit a thousand subscribers, besides a special video, I will start doing more gaming videos and not just like, well, not even just Happy Wheels or Would You Rather. I'm going to be starting to do actual video games because I do have a software that I'm able to record things from my uh, console and I also want to do some actual video games from my PC so yeah I really want to start doing more like gaming things on my channel than just reactions so hopefully you guys are open to everything that I've been talking about um, if not then you know just stick for the stuff that you want to stick for um, I will always keep uh, like once I start something I'm not gonna just stop it I'm gonna keep going even if it does take some time stick with me and I assure you that you will not be disappointed but yeah I kind of went off on a tangent here with a lot of stuff on the video but it is the first episode so hope you guys enjoyed my first episode of it's Saturday really had a not a hard time thinking of a title but I was like what should I call this series because I was thinking I want to have a day where I can just talk about stuff because at first I was gonna be like no I'm just gonna do movie reviews have separate videos for that but you know, I was, I was like, no. Too many people do that. I want to have something where it's like a day. Where it's a vlog, but I'm just sitting here talking to you guys. And it's not just updates. It's stuff like that. It's more just kind of like talking about what's going on in my life. And what I've done. And just what I think about stuff. And yeah. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you're here this still this long, thank you. Thank you guys for all of your support. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace, guys.